The monthly cattle and feed report is scheduled for release Friday after being delayed due to the partial government shutdown. UB Newswires has published updated estimates for the January report showing 2.2 percent more animals in the nation's feed yards as of January 1st compared with a year earlier. Analysts put placements or young cattle entering the feed yards during the month of December at 1.8 percent over a year ago. Marketings or those shipped out for slaughter in December were projected on average to be 0.2 percent under a year ago. For more on the upcoming cattle and feed report, subscribers should click on the news link in Comtel. In other news, save the date because National Clam Chowder Day is February 25th. Here's CFA News Managing Editor Amanda Buckle with the story. It doesn't matter if you're a traditional New England clam chowder lover or on Team Manhattan Clam Chowder because on Monday, February 25th, everyone can celebrate National Clam Chowder Day. Clam processor Sea Watch International is celebrating the day by providing thousands of bowls of clam chowder to shelters and food pantries across the country. And this isn't their first time using warm cups of chowder to warm some hearts. The company has been celebrating National Clam Chowder Day for the past couple of years by donating their signature clam chowder to those in need along the East and West Coast. Visit seafoodnews.com or click the Seafood tab in Comtel to learn more. Thanks, Amanda. That concludes our show for today. Thanks for watching and be sure to visit Comtel for the latest market and industry news. Today's video is sponsored by Episano's Market Insight for the Meat Industry, providing information, education, and insight for the beef, pork, and poultry industries. View a sample report at Episano.com or call 800-932-0617 to get your free sample today.